we have created this society. Not each one of us, but our past generations. We have those and us have created this present immoral, destructive society. And we are trapped by that society. That society is made by each one of us, so we are responsible for that society. Whether it is possible not to change society, but is it, is it possible to radically, deeply transform our condition which is understand deeply our consciousness, which is what we are. Is it possible to transform not into something, but to change, bring about a mutation in the very structure and nature of our consciousness? That is the problem. That is the crisis. It's not political crisis, economic crisis, or the crisis of war, but the crisis is in our in our in ourselves, and we apparently cannot face that crisis. Are unwilling to face it. And so we try to escape from that fact through various forms of entertainment, religious, political, football, and all the rest of it. And also, as we have seen yesterday morning, the content of our consciousness, the content being what you think, what you feel, your reactions, your longings, your despairs, your pleasures, your depressions, your faith, your dogmas, your sorrow, your beliefs, your desperate loneliness, and the fear of ultimate death, for that all that is your consciousness, that's what you are. And we are asking together whether that the content can be, can the, can the content end 